Hello friends and family, welcome to another episode of Your Daily Word with Pastor William Sunu of Joy Christian Center. It is always a joy to bring the Word of God um, to you on a daily basis, just to encourage your walk with the Lord, lift up your spirit and, and challenge you to go to the next level in your walk with God. Praise the Lord. Well, today we are in Ephesians chapter 3 verse 1 to 5 and I'm still taking basically my main um, text from the New Living Translation of the Bible. Now, in this portion, the Bible says, When I think of all this, I, Paul, a prisoner of Christ Jesus, for the benefit of you Gentiles, assuming by the way that you know God gave me the special responsibility of extending his grace to you Gentiles. As I briefly wrote earlier, God himself revealed his mysterious plans to me. As you read what I have written, you will understand my insight into the plan regarding Christ. God did not reveal it to previous generations, but now by his spirit, he has revealed it to his holy apostles and prophets. God's grace has been extended to you and me because God's plan was revealed to Paul and he put it into writing grace to you that's the way the christians used to greet themselves in those days now imagine if the apostle paul did not record what god revealed to him well let me take a moment to emphasize the importance of record keeping do you keep journals whether you do it electronically or manually you need a system of record keeping A good system of record keeping. A journal where you record your prayers and the answers that, you know, God gave. You need a book where you record your dreams. Another book to keep your financial records, etc., etc. As a Christian, you've, you've got to be good with record keeping. The benefit of keeping records of your prayers and the answers that God gave to those prayers, for example, is that it serves as a faith booster because the day will come when your faith will come under attack or the enemy will raise doubts in your minds, you know, or when you hit that rock bottom um, period in your faith or in your walk with God, your record of answered prayers will help you to say to the devil, checkmate, I have a record here that God answers prayer. Well, continuing with Paul's message. I praise God that Paul wrote his insight down so we can read it and understand and know the mystery that God kept from the ages past and also reveal them in Christ Jesus. Part of the plan that God revealed to Paul is that in Christ, both Jews and Gentiles are one. The revelation was given to the apostles and prophets. It was the ministry of the apostles and the New Testament prophets that took the gospel beyond the borders of Israel to the rest of the world. And their work is preserved in the Holy Scriptures for us to read and understand. This was how God extended his grace to you and me. Oh, may his grace abound. Through the faithful ministry of the apostles and prophets, God preserved his work. We have all been called to preach this good news to every creature. So my friend, my brother, my sister, let's get busy. Let's get busy sharing the good news. And let's make it a point to always keep a record of whatever God reveals to us, whether in a dream, whether through reading the scriptures, or whether in prayer, or whether in an open vision, keep a record of those things. Because you never know. One day that will come in handy it will serve as a faith booster or it will serve as a record that indeed you are a person who heard clearly from god almighty so sila on this message and don't forget to share with your friend and your loved ones may the lord bless you and may your day 
be a peaceful one.